Yeah, man, sometimes it's like we uh, keep our minds so much in the past and focus on those things, like past experiences that probably didn't go the way we wanted them to go. Um, a lot. I'm just watering my microgreens, y'all. Um, but what ends up happening when you do that, or when we do that, is you begin to develop anxiety or depression, right? Because now you begin to recall something that um, may have been your first time going through, a bad experience, uh, especially when it comes to building stuff. That's mainly what I'm talking about right now. Um, but we, be that a business or something else, uh, you may have had a bad experience or shit, somebody else that you know had a bad experience and they told you and you got shook. Um, like, I think a lot of times, man, you, 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 you can't really rely on those past experiences to guide you. I mean, you know, the best thing you could probably do is learn from those past experiences and then push on and know that you can push on and that those past experiences now are valuable to you because they're a lesson that like a drop or gym in uh, a drop of a gym, <laughs> a gym drop uh, in your bucket, you know what I'm saying? Your bucket of wisdom, you dig? Um, those are very important things, man. So you got to take them L's sometimes in order to get the dubs, man. Those L's is nothing more than like little gyms. That's all they are. They're not really L's. It's too bad that that's the way that we have to go about it, um, looking at it. Uh, it's really, it's really, uh, yeah, it really sucks. Anyway, just wanted to put that on you, man. Don't be afraid of getting after what it is that you got to get after. You dig? Just because something else happened. or You know what I'm saying? It's your vision. If you got excited about it, push. Peace.